Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to show you how to crochet doll wig by loop stitch. This is a doll wig by loop stitch, what I have done before. When you place this one onto the head, then gonna be look like that. So pretty. So Basically, when I make doll hair, I probably love to use small hair yarn, just wrap on a hard paper, as in the video I show you before. But today, we are working by loop stitch. So let's start. Okay. First, I do six single crochet into magic link, and then you just use another color yarn, mark as here. So normally when you do a uh, single crochet into a uh, work row, you are you are a uh, left hand working, the yarn gonna wrap in your finger like this, yeah, right? And now when we do a uh, loop stitch, the yarn gonna be in the front side of your finger like that. Okay, and I will do two loop stitch in each stitches allow so your needle gonna to go back side of your uh, work yarn and grab grab this yarn into the stitch like that so and then you just slip single crochet like that so now you got this loop stitch and then I will doing one more time the same stitch We're gonna to do a uh, two loop stitch in each stitches. Okay. I think this loop stitch is quite complicated for the beginner. If you do a uh, step by step, I think it helps you to make a uh, loop stitch as well. And the uh, next row, I'm gonna to do loop stitch in the next stitch. and two loop stitch in the next stitch and then I'm gonna to uh, repeat the same what I have done here allow And next row, I'm gonna to do a loop stitch in the next two stitches, and then two loop stitch in the next stitch. Okay.
So next round, I'm gonna to do a loop stitch in the next T stitches and two loop stitch in the next stitch. Next round, I'm gonna to do a loop stitch in the next four stitches and then two loop stitch in the next stitch. So, one, two. So right now I got six row. I do increase from row two to row six by two loop stitch together, and row seven to row ten, I gonna to do one loop stitch in each stitches. Then uh, it's gonna be like that. This one's completely ten row. Basically, when we work by one single crochet this side is gonna be the right size and this side is the wrong size and now for the door wick I use as a wrong side as a right size okay that side is have to matching with the your door hair when you place on like that so so I hope this video helping you to make door wigs 